Turns out there's a cellar down here. And I was testing everything. There's a lot of good stuff down there. I highly recommend it. I didn't. <laughs> Frankly, I've gone along and trying to find everything else, but right now I gotta go. this don't work, so help me, I'm going to be buying a new mic. I don't know what else to do. I've tried front ports, back ports, settings. I've even tried using my Zoom H1. I got the exact same results of so much, um, too much volume and not enough volume and all this other stuff. And it's just ridiculous. I don't know what's going on. I mean, buying a brand new mic here in the world don't work out. Or not. What's going Let's on? See. Right now I'm going to dump everything in here. There, that helps a little. Anyway, um, I want to give you a quick overview of what's been going on with me. This game. It has been... I've done a lot of off-camera looting, looking for things, that type of good stuff. Um, actually got a new mission, accidentally. I was out looting in this area, and I just kept looting over here and looting. And I ran, to, ran across this. It's a big ship heat lockup. Um, wasn't really much there that I noticed. A lot of loot, good loot, but um, nothing else. Wasn't really much to fight, even. Just some bugs, and I think a zombie, too. But whatever. Anyway, and then I ran across the Abernathy farm, and they gave me a mission. Now, I'm not going to go into all the details, but they basically gave me a mission to retrieve that. She could slide this. Anyway, to retrieve a locket from Station Olivia, which is on my way to Tin Pines Bluff. So I can kill two birds with one stone here. Really nice. Anyway, that's about it. Um, still got the Corvega assembly plan on my list. Of places, but if you look at my quests, if I can find my quests anyway, at the locket, go to Diamond City and talk to the settler. So I can do both of those. And these guys over here actually knew about the minute mill, so they were kind of happy to see me. And that's good to know. Um, went back to Vault 111, and despite the best rumors, um, having the dog still didn't allow me to open up the a weapon or whatever, but uh, went I went looting all through here trying to find some good stuff. Figured that wouldn't do anything, and actually didn't do this. So anyway, that's what's been going on with me. So sorry if you missed. It. Sorry that you missed it. But that's the way life goes sometimes. I am tired of not playing this game that I really like, and I'm tired of being stuck waiting for my mic to work. So. That's what's going on there. Um, as far as weapons go, done a little bit of modifications to weapons. Um, not that one I haven't done that much to. I added a scope to my laser musket. Got a machete. And this baby. Now this is nice. I'm going to go show you quick what's going on here. And I've got a compensated hardened 10mm pistol upgraded that. 
close sight calibrated pipe rifle. I found that. Uh, close sight heavy bolt action pistol, heavy pipe pistol. Now I've got a heavy pipe sniper rifle, which is really nice. It shoots, but it only shoots 38s. There's my machete. That's actually a really nice weapon. 18 damage in a swinging, and that's just awesome. That's more damage than my pipe rifle. Of course, I've got my minigun and nothing to do with it. Um, bolt, bolt action sniper rifle. Now, this is being my normally would be my default sniper weapon because it's got a 34 damage, just a 308 round. Then I realized that I and I didn't even see that before. Nice, I can uh, I'm gonna have to upgrade that. Ooh. Both nice. Work on those. I'm gonna put a scope on my laser musket, so. Got short scope. But the one that matters, I ran across this baby. So 308 is a real sniper rifle. Came with a short barrel and a pistol grip, but I have since improved upon it substantially. Still got the standard receiver, added the long barrel, gave it the full stock, still got a standard magazine, but I gave it a nice medium scope, that's all I could give it initially. And man, is this thing killer. I mean, 37 damage, it's just the problem. I still can do it. Let's see if I can upgrade that receiver. Yeah, that'll make it a 40. Six. Oh. Okay, that's gotta have gun nut too. So, need two more screws. I think I'm gonna hold off that. Look at that, 55 damage. And if I can do a sneak, that's gonna be 110 damage. That's just freaking awesome, dude. That's. So I'm gonna get find two more screws. I probably find some fans. So I'm gonna hold off on upgrading that hard receiver. That is impressive. That powerful receiver. Look at this. Look at this guy. It's just, jeez, that's great. So it's got the long girdle, muzzle. I can add my bayonet to it. It's actually found one, but I don't plan on being in that type of scenario. That's an idea. <coughs> True sniper rifle. Ooh. Okay, anyway, that's my new baby. I wanted to show that off real fast. So, let's go back over here and put everything in. I don't need. Now, also on perks, let me show you my perks. I did do some perk upgrading, I upgraded my intelligence. And I got my gun nut, I think, as you already saw. And I got advanced locksmithing because I got tired of wearing the locks I can't pick. And I've got scrapper because I want to get stuff out of stuff. And I got science because that's I'm, basically what I'm wanting to do now that I've thought about this is I want to play the smart tech. You know, not sure what you would call this, but basically, like if you're playing Shadowrun, not quite a hacker type, but still. Smart guy. Thought about the pickpocket drop. Really. This is what I, I'm gonna get that I made in my next um upgrade I'm thinking of having. So I'm not a hacker. But I wanna get the leader, horn leader, which I never as well. So I can't do that yet until I have my charisma. Anyway, with local leader you can establish supply lines between workshop settlements, and that's important. I've got quite a bit more charisma than that's something that's probably what I'm gonna shoot for next, because I am tired of lugging all my junk around. I can establish these settlements and then make short trips when I'll run into good places to barter. So there's that. That's what's going on. There's the update, so there's 10 minutes of update. Sorry it took so long. 
We are off to Ten Plank Bluff. So I keep this straight, but I need to do some quick transfers here, and I'm just going to cut this right here until I get the transfers done. Okay, uh, every, all that's done. So let's go ahead now. And um, oh, also there was a battery under here. I totally had missed all the time, so hopefully that'll come in. Something if someone would love to tell me, I'd appreciate it. Is seeing a lot of my parts that I'm taking off here, my you know standard grip for the 10 millimeter so forth. Um, let's see if it's under weapons. It's not. But anyway, like um, various mods that I took off, like I took, is they're sitting here and I don't know how to get them back on different options actually. So like there, there it is, like hunting barrel short rifle. So if I want to put the short barrel rifled on, it looks like it's not options or like I had bayonet it's here. Yeah. Oh I had it. They probably didn't call it a bayonet. Anyway I had like a just literally like a bayonet and went to go add it to another weapon and it wasn't there. So not sure what's up with that. Anyway, so onto our map and off to 10 times 12. So, okay. Probably just reorganize my. Oh, my dog. I did that out too. Then. I tell my dog to go somewhere again. He, I'm really bad at that. Here, doggy, 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 doggy. Good boy. I'm gonna be upset if I can't find my dog and can't. All my quest now. Everything is set. Here, doggy, doggy. Cogsworth for a little bit. I follow him. So now my dog is somewhere. I told him to stay in sanctuary. You'd think he'd stay here. You know, I see neither Cogsworth nor my dog. That's gonna suck. Where they went in my house? In my house? I don't know where I'm going to find it at. Great. That's what I need. Finally, going to go and find the dog. <laughs> oh boy. If you heard that, my wife just said to call him. That's nice, but he's over to be, I gotta go find him to talk to him. So here's Cogsworth, so they should be around here. Oh, if not, then I will have to make this quick <laughs> episode because I don't want to head off without him. It's too useful. Also a good mule. Maybe, I mean, you know, I may post this for comedic sake. Can't find the dog. He hid in one of these dog houses. I know I told him to stay here, not go to not go to Red Rocket. I made a point to do that. So you'd think he'd be around here.
Good boy. Here, doggy, doggy. Ah, what did I say? He found him a doghouse. He actually found him a doghouse. Nice. Hey, boy. He actually found a doghouse. Come on, boy. It's time to go. Nice. That's good to know. He actually will find a doghouse if you leave him. <laughs> Cute. Okay. Here he comes. I had no idea he would find a doghouse. Let's check my own missions. Make sure I'm really... I didn't accidentally do something. Okay. Yep, I didn't. Okay. So off we go. Let's get the first place. So let's find a weapon. Ooh, that's a nice one. I'm still learning where I'm putting for my gun. Every time I try, I thought it was R, but it's not working. Let's see. So the question is, is do I want to go retrieve that locket first, or get it on my way back? Either way, it'll give me two settlements. I've been needing to go to Ten Pines Bluff for a while. Probably should just go there. Hello. Poor guy. Dead. I'll take his stuff. Some nice ammo. Baseball club. Probably good leather. He's all of it. Nice. Uh oh. Mole rats. Fungus. Cute. Yeah, same light, I guess. Okay. Go again. The river through the woods, and here we go. I can actually plant the silver so it's not good. Okay, so I can go deal with these guys now. Or you know, let's let's get them on the way back. I think that's gonna be what I've got time for. Lock it and go in there. My, my older mission is to go is to go talk to the guys over here and get that story going. But uh, generally, uh, oh, and I forgot to say the story behind those guys is um, there's a farm like I was talking about, and basically they more or less have killed their killed their daughter and stole her locket and they want the locket back for sentimental purposes, etc. They asked me to help them out and go get it. That's what we're doing. Hey, here we go. It's Ten Pines Bluff. And from what I know of, if I do what these people won't, 
and get myself some settlements and some allies and all that kind of good stuff. Search for my own kit. Wild carrot flower. That may be something. Why? Hey, dog, tell me when you're fighting something. Off we go. Gonna plant the carrots back home too. This gun really isn't very good. I need to really do everything I can to him. Because there's a lot of 38 ammo running around for some reason. In Pine's Bluff. Let's go. They awake or they sleep. They're asleep. Eh, boy. All right. Any food, by the way? Baked low fly. Why not? Else? Nope. Oh well. Little food. What do you want? We don't need any more trouble around here. I'm not trying to give you trouble. It's for help. Didn't you ask the Minutemen for help? You're with the Minutemen? I didn't really think you fellas still existed. We sent word with one of them passing traders, but honestly, I never expected anything to come of it. Most people don't put much stock in the Minutemen these days after Quincy. Bad business, that. I didn't expect to get lectured by the people I came to help. I didn't mean to give offense. I'm damn glad you're here, no mistake. There's a raider gang that's been giving us trouble for weeks. Stealing food and supplies, threatening to kill us all if we don't pony up. We know where they're coming from, but we can't go up against a gang like that. Will you be willing to join the Minutemen once I've dealt with those raiders? Well, we'll certainly give it a good long think. People have gotten used to not being able to count on you folks. That's not gonna change overnight. Okay, so... <clears throat> Another day of hard work. It never changes. Did I actually get that mission? Didn't think I got that mission. Okay, I did. Didn't look like I did. That was really fast. Hey! I load him up. No, I didn't. Let's get him. They would quit going to the tab. Okay. Well, I know that was at the Corvega assembly plant. Way down here. I definitely don't got time to go there. Okay. So. Hmm. Yeah, 
but I hate to call it such a quick episode, but it's late, and that's going to take another 20 to 30 minutes at least to do that. I, want, I like to try to keep these in the 30 minute mark, 20 to 30 minute mark. So we're going to call this tonight. Let's sit here. Let's, let's just stop recording right here. Hmm, there's something in the background. It's nice. Check that out later too. I'll be shooting. Everyone likes to shoot. But we're here. Let's just call it a call it for now. And um next episode, I will go back to the satellite dish and lock it back. See so I don't get distracted, and just go on from there. See what happens. Thanks for watching.